Shalom, the Lord bless you. Welcome to Purpose and Marita Bliss with Pastor Honorine. I have a prophetic word for someone. Someone badly needs to apologize to you. Someone badly needs to apologize to you. This word is coming to someone. Someone you know stabbed you in the back. Someone close to you betrayed you. Someone close to you stabbed you in the back. Someone close to you double-crossed you. Someone close to you cheated you or cheated on you. And right now, you realized it, or maybe you've not even realized it, but God took it personal and decided to fight for you. Their peace has been taken away. Their conscience has, has not given them rest. And right now, they can't sleep. They are desperate to apologize to you. They badly need to apologize to you. A part of them doesn't want to disclose the fact that they are behind your predicament. They are the reason why you went through the challenges that you went through. But God is putting them under pressure to apologize to you. Now, you, God expects you to forgive them when they do. They are going to apologize and God expects you to forgive them. But they must not remain your friend. They must not remain close to you. You might forgive them, but you don't need to keep them in your innermost circle. You might forgive them, but you don't need to keep them close to you. That is the decision you are supposed to make by yourself. But wisdom will tell you if they did it now, they might do it again. And remember, they are not apologizing because they felt remorseful the moment they did that. They are apologizing because God has put them under the tight place, in between a tight in a tight corner. They are apologizing because God has them in a tight corner. So meaning if they have another opportunity or if they know that they can do that and get away with it, they will still do that. Hallelujah. And besides, sorry is not always it. A better apology than saying sorry is genuine repentance. God bless you. Shalom.